So tonight, a community is saying its final goodbyes to a Buffalo father who paid the ultimate price. It's a tragedy that touched hearts everywhere. 24-year-old Demetrius Johnson Sr. tried saving his kids from a fire on Humber Avenue a week ago today. He didn't make it back out of the home. As 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley tells us, Johnson was a father who died a hero. It was an emotional day at St. John Baptist Church as friends, family, and the community gathered for the funeral of 24-year-old Demetrius Johnson. Last week, the father of four children rescued his fiancée and badly burned daughter from this house fire on Humber Avenue. But Johnson went back in to get a young son and another person who lived in the home, and he never came back out. Hero! meets to his friends and during the wake portion of the service he was remembered for his good nature Oh, he was, he was a jokester. He always kept us smiling, laughing. Many praised his heroic actions and said they should be an example to others. We may not be able to save everybody but we should not shirk any opportunity not to try. Johnson's eight-year-old daughter, Treasure Thomas, remains at Shriners Hospital in Cincinnati after suffering burns over 90% of her body. Her mother, Tempest Thomas, by her side. She actually is breathing on her own, so they took the breathing machine off and she went in for her fourth surgery at, at about 10 o'clock this morning. She's doing amazing. This tragedy touched the hearts of people all over the country and there has been a great outpouring of support and donations. The community has been overwhelming. It's been great. For heartbroken family members, it was a difficult day only tempered by the fact that Demetrius Johnson will always be remembered as a hero. The Demetrius Johnson Sr. was laid to rest in St. Matthew's Cemetery, and a GoFundMe account to help the family has already raised nearly $12,000. And several times today during the funeral, the family wanted to thank the community, letting them know that all the support they have been receiving has been very important as they deal with this tragedy. Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News. A powerful tribute. Thank you, Ed. If you would like to help the fire victims, there is now an account set up through First Niagara Bank. You can send donations to the Demetrius Johnson Fund, care of Centennial Baptist Church, 299 High Street in Buffalo. The zip is 14202. We've also posted this information on our 7 Eyewitness News Facebook page.